Jim Barry from Mbari here with some exciting news about an octopus oasis right here in our backyard. Okay, now we're ready to go ahead and pick up. Welcome to Davidson Seamount. This stunning extinct underwater volcano is just 90 miles southwest of Mbari headquarters in Moss Landing, California. It was here that researchers observed thousands of octopus incubating their eggs. We call this behavior brooding. Meet Moose Octopus Robustus. We nicknamed this species the Pearl Octopus because from a distance, the nesting octopus look like opalescent pearls scattered across the seafloor. In terms of scale, these animals are about the size of a grapefruit. This massive aggregation of brooding octopus was first recorded in October 2018 by scientists from the Monterey Bay National Marine Sanctuary and Nautilus Live. The discovery of the octopus garden was streamed online and immediately captured the attention of ocean enthusiasts around the world. Of course, it sparked our curiosity too. What makes this location so special? Is it the food, the company, or maybe something else the garden is providing. The Ambari research team visited the octopus garden 14 times over the course of three years to learn more. We surveyed the area using a suite of advanced technologies, including many custom built by Ambari engineers. An innovative sensor suite on our robotic submersible dock rickets combined lasers and high resolution photography to map parts of the octopus garden in remarkable centimeter scale detail. We counted more than 6,000 octopus in just a part of the octopus garden, but there are likely more than 20,000 in total. Our skilled pilots carefully maneuvered instruments inside and around the octopus nests to gently measure water conditions like temperature and oxygen. And we deployed a time-lapse camera to continuously monitor the activities in one patch of brooding moms over a six-month period of time. These technologies allowed us to confirm an initial hunch. The octopus nests were clustered in crevices bathed by warm hydrothermal springs. Our detailed maps, combined with the unique scarring found on many of the animals, allowed us to identify individual moms closely monitor their developing embryos and determine how long it took the eggs to hatch. We know from the scientific literature that octopus brood periods respond strongly to ocean temperature. The colder the water, the slower the eggs will develop. In the frigid waters found at these depths, nearly two miles deep, we expected it would take five to eight years or even longer for octopus eggs to hatch but we were amazed to learn that the eggs at the octopus garden hatched in less than two years. Because the octopus moms are nesting in warm spring waters, their eggs develop much faster and incubation times are greatly decreased. Going from egg to hatchling isn't easy. In addition to developing successfully, embryos must avoid predation, infection, injury, and more. Maternal care helps protect them from these threats but sadly, sometimes a mom runs out of energy and dies before her eggs hatch. A shorter brood period reduces the risk that developing embryos will be injured or eaten, ensuring that more will survive. Warmth from the hydrothermal springs very likely gives them a big boost. As with other octopus species, pearl octopus die soon after reproducing. Their job is done and their journey is complete. But nothing goes to waste in the deep sea. The octopus bodies become an important source of food for the shrimps, snails, anemones, and other animals that call this special place home. The octopus garden supports a thriving community of life. Essential biological hotspots like this deep sea nursery need to be preserved. Fortunately, thanks to ocean champions like you, the Monterey Bay National Marine Sanctuary now protects Davidson Seamount and the Octopus Garden. But in other regions, threats like deep sea mining have the potential to harm these remarkable underwater communities. We expect there may be many more areas like this that remain undiscovered. 
Share what you've learned and let's raise awareness for protecting the unique animals and environments that dwell deep beneath the ocean's surface. For the entire team here at Ambari, thanks for watching and be sure to follow us on YouTube.